Hiya there, I'm just going to show you our lettuces that I've planted out this morning. There is a little video that comes after this um, introduction and I apologise for all the interruptions that took place. Yes, you'll see the GoPro kept falling over because I don't have a cameraman. My mum called me in the middle of it and as much as I felt I had everything ready in preparation for um, planting them out, I've forgotten the um, compost as well. So apologies for the mess that the video's in. I don't know how to edit it. I haven't figured that bit out yet. Um, but it is what it is. And it's us and me, what's and all. Okay, so here's our lettuce. I'll just show you here. These out this morning. These are our little gems. I put them about six inches apart all the way up. We've got nine on one side and nine on the other, and I've puddled them all in. And these are the first of our lettuce that we've put out. We've also sown some Lolo Rosso um, this weekend and some um, spicy leaves, which are sort of like a cut and come as well. So you'll get to see the rest of the video on planting out lettuces gets to look like later. Thanks, bye. <clears throat> Hiya, I'm not sure if you can see me or quite how this is going to work. Um, I might just adjust that a little bit, see how that is. Got the whoop. I was going to say, I have the GoPro set up in a curious way. As you can see, it appears. Hopefully that's a bit more stable and you can get to see me as well in here. What I'm doing this morning is I'm going to pot out some of our lettuces. So we've grown some um, little gem seeds in this plant pot here and there are absolutely dozens of these seedlings now, these pots. And what I've got here is I've got Keith and Rodney built, made me this um, raised bed a couple of years ago now um, out of old sleepers. And this is um, the spot behind where the camera is, is where the herbs are. And this is where I grow lettuces. And that's the other sort of herby type of um, odd bits and pieces that we do when we fancy anything. So what I've done is I've hoed this area over completely. And then after hoeing it, let me get up. <laughs> Oops. I've levelled it out with the rake. So I would have just done something like this with the rake and then after that I want it flattened so I've just taken the rake and flattened it down like this just to be able to level it all out. You want it as level as you can and that's what I've done there. I've got a stick here that is measured every four inches and that's how much far apart we're going to pop them. So. this end you might be able to get to see what I'm doing then and hear it as well. So all I'm going to do is I'm about there, take my trowel and make a little hole. It needs to be so deep and then I'm just going to squeeze out these from the pot as you can see you can see all the root system where you might be able to get to see the root system there. And as we did before, you want to just prise these apart. Some of them will get some damage, some of them won't. Just don't to be too delicate, prise them apart. This is a good one. I've taken there. So we've got our seedling, as you know, to hold it by the leaf and not by the stem. And most definitely not by the root system. Greenhouse. 
sure. Oh, hang on a minute, for phone call. I'm in the I'm in the plot. Oh right. Yeah. Yeah. Are I mean, you digging? No, I'm not doing any digging. I'm just doing a video diary at the moment. My mum's just phoned me. And um I'm planting lettuces. So here we go. Can you see? Oh yeah. Little gem yeah. lettuces. So we're doing that. And Rodney's in the greenhouse and he is planting tomatoes. Yeah. Oh, right. Is he all right? He's fine. Yeah, he's okay. He's COVID-19 free from what we can see. And we're maintaining our two um, metres apart. Mm. Oh, right. Okay. What are okay. you up to? Uh, well, what are you I just up to? watered all my plants. You watered your plants? Yeah. That was a big job, broke out. Yes. Took me tablets, made me bed. Yeah. And that, that, uh, that's about it. Okay. Um, what can you say to you? When are you going to um, Aldi? Um, probably Thursday, Thursday night. Oh, Thursday. Oh, that'll do. Uh, do us a favour. Yeah. When you go, I once a month I get Becky nappies. Okay. You know the big ones, uh, fifteen pound to twenty pounds. Okay. Baby's waist I'm talking about. Okay. They're in the green uh, they're in the green wrapper, I think they're two ninety nine. Okay. And uh, two coffees. Okie dokie. That's about it. Yeah. Okay. Well I'll see you tomorrow what you're shopping from tomorrow. Oh right, okay. Yeah, yeah. because I'm yeah, doing that in, yeah, in the morning, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. All right, see you soon. Yeah, brother was asking. I will. My brother was asking about him. I will. Okay. All right, bye. Sure. Bye. 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 <sighs> Funny as that. Video call, WhatsApp, video call from my mum. Since we've managed to teach her it, she's not stopped doing it. Right, so let's get back to the planting. We're just going to make a hole. Get this. Actually, Rodney. Do we not usually put some compost in this hole? We do, we need a little bit of compost, don't we? Yeah, quite forgot about that bit. What we do is we get a little bit of compost, um, just so it's a similar medium to what the plants already come out of, and just make that little hole. Drop a bit of compost into it, because this soil is really quite dry. Take your seedling, pop it in there, and then that's it. And all you get to do then is water it in, give it a little puddle, and that's that. So I'm going to do the whole row along here now, uh, three, four inches, put one of these plants in. We've got really too many here, so what I might do is I might put some of them into um, some bigger plant pots, individual plant pots, or if we can find some troughs that we've not used at the moment, I'll pop them in there as well. And it's just taking them. So what I'm going to do now is just lay them along here so we can see how many I've got and how far I'm going to go. I've got quite a nice 
root there. Run as much of the original soil as you can on there. Okay, this that one is not great if I've got a lot of um, soil around it. It's not going to say I'm going to waste them. I'm just not going to put it in here. I want something with quite an established root ball to be able to survive. That's a little skinny one. This one here. See, they're a lot better. That one will go in. We normally try, if we can, to stagger our lettuces as well. So what we have done is we've also sown some seeds for some Lalo Rosso. And we've also sown, that one, we've sown some seeds for um, just spicy leaves. Um, so they're in the greenhouse at the moment. And they were only sown at the weekend. Whereas these little gems, they were sown at the beginning of March. So you can see now it's the 7th of April. So it doesn't take long for your plant to establish into a fairly decent seedling. How many have got on this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm going to have about 12 of these lettuces. And then all we'll do is either pick the whole thing. Well, very often what I get to do is just pick leaves from it and that's what I'm going to be doing this morning so I'll catch up with you soon